everyone, we're back. My name is Miskaya Tanager, and I am playing some Fallout 3 Point Lookout DLC. I can't remember the name of the damn DLC. Okay, so now we just have to go talk to Desmond and tell, like, ask him, you know, or tell him, you know, some shit. <laughs> like, I just got super high, <laughs> and some things happened. I made some life choices. I lost part of my brain. Sup, nerd? You infiltrated those tribals yet? Yup. Uh, I found out where their leader is hiding. And you didn't go track him down and grill him for information. I'm not your daddy. <laughs> Don't waste your time checking in. Go find him and figure out what he wants with this place, you moron. Okay, nerd. Should I work with you again? What's the difference between you and me, kid? What makes a gifted killer like yourself into a rock-hard bastard like me? <laughs> I the like answer him. is training, you ignorant fuck. I've got a hundred years of experience on you. And don't you forget it. Stick by me and you'll get a master's class in doing what has to be done. Okay, nerd. Back to business. How do I have a... Why do I feel like I'm going to have to choose between this guy, between Desmond, and the tribals? Uh, I was like, why do why do I feel like this is going to end poorly? Where the hell am I going? Yeah, no, fuck that noise. <laughs> Fast travel. <laughs> I ain't got time for that. I got shit to do. <laughs> oh, he look a well. Oh damn it! I was gonna jump in the well. Let me guess, there's ghouls in the graveyard. Sigh. <laughs> Bad thing about not using the alien disintegrator is, you know, I can't one shot everything with a headshot. Unless I get a crit. Ooh! The fuck? Hi, nerd. What's attacking me? Aw, ghouls think that they can kill me. It's so cute. Oh, fuck! The fuck? The fuck are you? No. No. No, 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 no! I said, no! <laughs> God, this thing's like trying to hit a truck! Okay. Okay, okay. I got I still got I still got alien I still got alien health. Come at me. Come at me. Ow, this thing is like a truck. Die, please. Leave me alone. So don't go to the graveyard. Help! Help! You know what? I'm just gonna kill that guy to get him off my ass. <laughs> Leave me alone! Leave me alone! No! What? <laughs> guy hits like a truck and I didn't have a chance to say- or I didn't have a chance to heal. Also, my suit has he has heals. I just noticed that. God damn it. <laughs> uh, I got myself into a state. I, I, I fell off a cliff? Sort of? Oh dear. <laughs> don't, don't kill me! Don't kill me, don't break my legs. Okay. You don't see me. You don't see me! I'm invisible! Invisibro. I am invisible. Okay, bye! I gotta go talk to some- someone. And tell him why he's an idiot. <clears throat> or, you know, ask him what he has against this particular mansion and or this particular ghoul? And if you could just, you know, leave him alone. Wait, what the fuck? Where? 
I thought I was on this. I thought I was on this level. Apparently not. Okay, bye. Is it up here? Oh. Okay. Right. Coastal Grotto. I wonder how this guy kept this secret so long. <laughs> See, because it's covered in freaking lanterns. Does nobody go exploring? Probably not. Also, how does he keep all of these lit so much? It's just a torch. Oh dear. Ooh. Drink. You don't need that, right? He's cool. Welcome. Welcome to my extraordinary safari. Shall we get you registered? Uh, bye. Pfft, your loss, I'm afraid. Come back if you reconsider. I'm in the wrong place. I'm in the wrong place. Okay! <laughs> Getting out of here! Oh my god, this looks more like a place. Wrecked sea tub. What's a sea tub? Hey! Wait, I had the key. Where did I get the key from? <laughs> oh, right, I got it from Nadine, didn't I? You didn't hear that? You didn't hear that? Oh, look! Brain fungus. Does it have my brain? Because I want my brain back. This jerk face ate my brain. I'm assuming that's what he did with it. I'm assuming he uh, cooked it up with some fava beans and had a nice Chianti with it. But, just my assumption. Granted, can't just take a chunk of someone's brain and, you know, It'd be fine. That's not that's not how biology works. Or science. You can't be fine after a brain injury. Maybe. Or he could be like Phineas Gage, who loses and gets like part of his uh, brain scrambled by a pipe and turns into a completely different person afterwards. <laughs> oh hey! There's a bunch of Meyer lurks in here. What the fuck is this guy getting around? Without getting. Yes, Desmond will die, and our long struggle will finally end the only way it could have, with me as the victor! Yes, and you will be able to spread your knowledge across the astral plane for all those. Oh god, he hates him because of a hologram? No, not astral knowledge, you simpleton. Psychic domination, and that still won't be possible until you destroy Desmond's jamming device. No need to worry, enlightened one. We shall reconsecrate. Mansion and remove the impurities disrupting your perfect guidance. Yes, fine. Go destroy the house and its impurities. Just stop that jammer, and I'll be free of you morons once and for all. <laughs> yes, we shall be free of all limitations. Thank you, Master. We shall be the instrument of your mighty will. You are insane. Hello. You are a fellow seeker of the higher planes, perhaps. What brings you here? Uh, it's not to meet the tribal I leader? I may be the man who leads our physical affairs, but I cannot claim true wisdom. I take my orders from a higher master. Yeah, from a Whether it brain be not and to a explore jar. higher planes, or the decision to remove the disruptive ghoul, all wisdom comes from the transcendent master. So you're not really in charge? Would that I was so wise. No. True leadership of the tribe belongs to the higher mind of the Enlightened One. Although his mind has moved beyond the need for flesh, his consciousness still returns here to guide our people. It's not how science I works. I merely <laughs> interpret his wishes. He manifests here, high on a ledge in the great sea cave's well. Perhaps if you are fortunate, he will choose to share his wisdom with you. Well, he probably wants to talk to somebody who's actually smart, so let's go yes. talk to him. Commune with him while I see to my tribe. There is much to be done. Okay, what is your malfunction? So you're the mouse that was scurrying around here? What's up, nerd? Not much to look at, but at least you're not drooling all over yourself. I can work with that. <laughs> Excuse me? Now then, perhaps you can be more useful than that simpering spiritualist and his tribe of idiots. What the 
hell are you? What you are interacting with is merely a holographic projection, and a rather clumsy one at that, but it's all I can manage at the moment. As for myself, you gaze upon one of America's greatest minds, preserved through the miracles of science! SCIENCE! <laughs> Um, but you don't have opposable thumbs, so you have to get other people to do your shit for you. Why did you come to lead this tribe? Ha! But why? What have you got against the ghoul? No, 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 you explain yourself, or I ain't doing shit for you. What do you know about Desmond? Explain? You still haven't given me any reason to side with you, my dude. Uh, Des Desmond's kind of funny. <laughs> You're a jerk. Oh, Desmond's a jerk too. Uh, did you tell the tribals to attack the mansion? Uh, were you the one who cut, had- are you- have you been having them cut people's brains open? Because that's probably why they're all dumb. Because you're having them cut brains open. Okay. Oh hey look! A way to get out easy. <laughs> well then. So... What's my quest say? Speak with Desmond! Hey Desmond, we need to have a discussion because this guy kind of wants to kill- oh right, I'm too close to the frickin' cemetery. Leave me alone. Okay. Now can I fast travel? This place is huge, I don't want to walk all the way. <laughs> Aqua Pura? When did I take Aqua Pura? When did I take Aqua Pura? I don't remember that. Oh well. Oh well. Hey, dude! Hey, dude! We need to have a discussion. I knew it. I knew that little bastard was behind all this. After all these years, he stuck his head out, and this is my chance to cut it off. Figuratively speaking, of course. Explain? So who's this brain thing? Him. I should have known. My old rival. So close to his family home. Only he would be so stupid. He was once a man. Professor Calvert. The Calverts owned half of Maryland. So this is his house. There was a Maryland to own. Members of the Calvert family were influential all over the world. They practically owned a deed to the U.S. government. Okay. In their best <laughs> days, there were no less than three Calvert family senators, seven members of the House, and two governors. Jeez, sounds they like even the... had a top candidate for president, until that scandal with the dog forced him to drop out of the race. I was particularly proud of that. What? <laughs> so they're like the um the uh, uh Kennedys. God, that took me way too long to remember that name. You know this guy? What's going on? Calvert is my old rival. Centuries we played this game. I knew he'd be stupid enough to hide so close to his family home. So he's it's who you're not looking a for. Of hate. It's a matter <sighs> of destiny. He is my enemy, and I do not suffer any bastard who opposes me to live. I knew he was here, and it is my intent to find him and call down a righteous fucking hammer on his head. Figurative, I mean. His head. <laughs> no literal hammer. 
So now you want me to do something else, right? Of course, I fucking want you to do something else. You don't expect me to trot around this mud hole myself, do you? Yes. Watch your tone! Oh, what? <laughs> you think I haven't been shot before? Think that you over the thousands who have tried can take me down? I have you a portable nuke. Up and play along. <laughs> I'll get what I want, and you'll get rich, and then we can go about our separate goddamn ways. Can't wait to hear this. So, those half-wits are getting messages from the professor, right? So he's off somewhere broadcasting to them. But without those buggers to do things for him, he can't do much for himself. Okay. So, we cut off his ability to talk to them, and he'll need to try harder. Okay. Maybe then I can find this squishy little worm and finish him off for good. Okay. So what's your plan, old man? If I know <laughs> Professor Calvert, and I do, he's using a high-frequency cognitive sign broadcast. A what? <laughs> I have a perfect device to jam up instead of talk box. All you need to do is take it to the highest point on the shore and install it. Easy, right? What is the catch? The big wheel down the... Oh, the Ferris wheel. Right. Attach it to the bottom car, then turn it on and spin the jammer to the top. No fucking problem. I'll watch from here and turn it on. Then we'll see where our little professor is. Now, go. I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> I have... I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> but fuck it, let's do it. Rain in a jar hasn't given me any reason to be on his side. Granted, I don't even know if there is a choice to be on his side yet. That game hasn't given me one. Hey, look, a Ferris wheel! Woo! It oh. is I, Professor Calvert. Hi. Don't bother looking around. I'm in your mind. Excuse me? But aren't you Desmond's faithful little employee? Coming to gum up my work, are we? Well, I have a better idea. Okay. How about instead of playing his game, you destroy that nasty little device? Deposit it in the nearby trash compactor and we will never have to worry about it again. How are you in my head? I assure you that the gratitude of Professor Calvert is worth a great deal more than that of a washed up old limey. Neither of you have given me a good reason to side with one of you or the other, uh, over the other. I do need to make sure I save Nadine, but I don't know if not siding with Professor Calvert is going to kill Nadine, like not, like siding against um, Arcadia ends up killing the person you're looking for there. <sighs> and to the quest. Solid cognitive jammer. Or just try to destroy it. Fuck it. Guy hasn't given me any reason to side with him. You fool! What have you done? You will pay for this! Pay! Cool story, nerd. No one betrays me! Oh yes. shit! <laughs> you will suffer for this! Wait, how did he know to send people? Where's your god now, bitch? <laughs> Impure my ass. Well, that was easy. Okay. Now I gotta go talk to frickin' Desmond again. What? There's more enemies. Where? Oh, there's still one. Somewhere? The fuck? Oh, he's up there! Aren't you tiny? There we go. Where the fuck are- th oh, there he is. <laughs> There's one over here. But I'm just gonna walk away because I don't freaking see him. There you are. What? Oh! 
Oh shit, hi! <laughs> oh wait, I need to... Hold on. I gotta take some pills. Okay, <laughs> bye! Oh, he's meat! I made him into meat! Can I make you into meat? I just want to make you into meat. How many meat can I make her? <laughs> that many meat. Leave me alone. I'm just trying to get this quest done. I kill you. I kill you. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> okay, I'm lazy. Fast travel. Desmond! I did what you wanted me to- Today, Desmond Lockhart will finally win out. He killed Sorry. puppies. We sided with the right side. He overplayed his hand this time. You and me are going to walk in there and end this. Goddamn right we are. How dare you kill puppies? Great to see you alive, I was worried. Well, aren't you a fucking softy? No. But Calvert is here. He's got a lab under the lighthouse, the little fuck. Right under my nose the whole time. Get him! I found it when he boosted his signal to try to get through the jamming. When he sent those tribals to kill my poor pups. Chilled pups. He's down there, hiding behind robots and machines, sucking life. Pathetic. He dies now. Yeah! We kill the puppy killer. Let's do it. Now, that's more like it. Follow me. You're about to witness the end of an era. How dare he kill puppies! Let's murder him! Don't kill puppies. Puppies are innocent. Animals are innocent. And cute. And adorable. You didn't have to kill the puppies. If you'd have killed Desmond, I'd have been more okay with it. But no, you had to go and kill the puppies. Um. But where. What fucking way are we going over there, I'm, dude? Are you just gonna swim? That can't be good for your gun. Oh, I guess there's a land bridge. <laughs> of sorts. The fuck are you going? <laughs> nom nom nom. Jackass took part of my brain, and he killed puppies. Fuck it, he dies. Come here, nerd. I'm gonna get you, nerd. Oh! Get him! <laughs> oh, he has a lab! I like labs. Hi, look. Nom. Nom. Ooh. Nom. Ooh. Nom. Where's Desmond? Desmond! Uh. Okay. 
Did he just run ahead of me? Okay, okay, there he is. I was like, wait a minute. Come back here! Keep up. He can't be far. I'm right next to you, Dillweed. Hurry up. Okay. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna hack it. Doobity dooby doo 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 doo. Do 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 don't know why I did that. Okay, so it's two. Um maybe that's one. Uh no. Americans! What about Americans? It could be this one. Okay, cool. Americans. Deactivate the turret system. I don't want to deal with that shit. Okay, but like- Oh! Switch. <laughs> there is a switch by the- Oh, fuck. Uh, hi! Bye! Super sneaks. Ooh, bullets! I got all so you know loot his entire deal. Damn it! <laughs> it's okay, I got enough. Mm, here? No. <laughs> uh, here. Here? Here. There we go. <laughs> I was gonna say nothing I give a crap about, but then there's stuff. Hmm. Science! I like science. It's a microscope. Microscope means science, and science is good. Oh, wait, no health. Kids, get out of here, nerd. Let's get him! <laughs> oh, hi! But I want the ammunition! Um, okay, fine. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to hit that. Um. Oops. I do this, and then I hit this, and then I hit, um. The last one. Oh, no. Bonk, bonk. It's not companies. It's not that one. Hmm. I didn't hit that. Excuse you. Uh, it's not companies. Companies have four. Distances? Yes! Cool. <laughs> I was like, should I back out and redo it, or should I risk it for the biscuit? I decided to risk it. Ooh, science. Ooh, science. Ooh, science. Oh, wait, what? Oh, shit. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. I just wanted the science. Do. Oh, hey, it opened this. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted the science that was in there. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm just trying to marvel at the science, dude. Oh, shit. How you doing? No, 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 no. Just no. It does feel weird. That there's so much crap in this place. Like, there's a lot of si beta level security badge. There's a lot of science in here. Hmm. I 
Thank you. Have a pleasant day. What if I don't want to have a pleasant day? Don't tell me what to do. Hi. <laughs> I ain't about that robo life. I ain't about it. I ain't about it. Marker, it's on this guy. Shit, son. Okay. Ah, he's got it. Hi! That's a lot of protectrons. Oh, I'm on the wrong side for this? Oops. Why would I do that? What kind of reward are we talking about here? You have not told me what this gift is. You cannot expect a person to do a thing for you if you don't tell them what you're going to give them. You must decide. Do it now. Hold on. I gotta make sure I'm in the right area in front of him. Oh, here comes trouble. Excuse me. Come over here, girl. Let's talk. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Now he wants to Jump down there. Neither of you have told me what which one to side with. Christ, you too. <laughs> Christ, you wouldn't shut up. Last, <laughs> the world is rid of that sniveling, disgusting, arrogant brain. Think of it. Everything he learned, everything he had, it's all here, and it's all mine. Mine. Calm down. What's so great about his stuff? Moron. You cannot possibly comprehend what this is worth. I've been battling with Calvert for over 200 years, and now at last, I am the victor. I helped. And now, 200 years of technology knowledge and research that he stole Wait, what do you mean me. he stole from you? Every time he beat me, it doesn't matter now. So where's my cut? You're free to take whatever you find in this disgusting place. Excellent! What I came for is of no interest to you. Enjoy your spoil. What did you come for? I don't think our paths will ever cross again. And I think we can both thank Christ and say hallelujah for that. Okay. I'm busy. What do you want? Uh, what are you doing down here? I'm pulling all the data that I can from Calvert's computers. Everything the little bastard gathered is here. 
And then, when I'm done, I'll leave this place to sink into the sea. Okay. What do you do now that he's dead? Now that we're rid of Calvert, I'll be heading north to pursue my next rival. Who's that? <laughs> there are only a few of us left now. The great game goes on. Sort of a... Uh, what's a word you'd understand? Microcosm? Yeah. It's a microcosm for the old world. Oh, so it's a bunch of people from the old world hunting each other down. Okay, cool. I think you're funny. But, ooh! Ooh. Come, um, no, no, no. Um, no, no. I want the stuff off of it. No, 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 no. <laughs> Not that I need any of it! <laughs> but, you know. Is that the only thing that was for? Is there anything else here? Turpentine. Broken century. Oh, this must be the other way that I bypassed by being smart. Okay. <laughs> well, alright then. Um, that's a little anticlimactic. Is that, uh... Still here, are you? Is that it? Oh. Oh, hey! Probably been faster than this, but this- Jesus Christ! What? What? What's killing me? What's killing me? There's nothing here! Fuck this shit, I'm out. Island is haunted. Oh, it's probably that guy shooting at me. Um, let's go see, uh... Let's go see how they're doing at the cathedral. They're probably all hostile to me. <laughs> oh, fuck, they are. I, I was joking. I, I was joking. Um. Hold on, I just need to double check. Uh, Nadine! Oh, they're not all hostile. Just a couple of them? What the hell? What the fuck? Hi! What? Uh, hi! Are any of you Nadine? No? Okay, bye! <laughs> I didn't expect them to actually go hostile on my ass. Uh, see you later. I don't want to kill you. That's mean. Don't make me. Don't make me do it. <sighs> you forced my hand. She could have gone back. Not my fault. Okay, I do remember Nadine mentioning something about, uh, 24, about waiting at the pier for me for 24 hours or something. So, oh, there she is! Hey, nerd. Hey, nerd. Hey, just in time. Found out who went rooting around in our skulls, and you'll never guess who it was. What? As a totally unrelated hint, I'm in charge of his boat now. What? Tobar did it? Yeah, looks like it. When the tribals would send someone to the swamp, he'd be waiting around to nab them when the Pungaseeds gassed him. He'd do his amateur surgery for the tribals and let us wander back, all in exchange for Punga fruit to trade. God damn it! <laughs> Sweet little deal he had going on. Anyway, I figured you'd want a shot at some revenge, so I put him under citizen's arrest. What Sorry. were they doing with the brains? <laughs> what a bastard! <laughs> Yeah, he seemed nice enough, didn't he? I wouldn't have figured it out if I hadn't snuck into his engine room while waiting for you. From the look of it, he kept every bit of gray matter he cut out, and he had quite a collection. You can take a look if your stomach's up to it. Can we put it back while in my head? There, feel free to give Tobar my love, preferably with the sharp end of a hot knife. Okay, so what are you going to do? First off, I'm claiming this boat. I put Tobar down, so it's mine. Them's the rules of the ocean. I'm okay with this. 
So that leaves me with a boat, a load of punga, and a wicked scar. Damn, if I haven't earned that adventure I came out looking for. You did good for yourself, I'm honey. Take over running this ship. I can travel as I like and always head back to the wasteland to see mom. Not a bad way to live, huh? Of course, you can always ride for free. Oh, hot damn! I'm okay with that. Okay. Come at me, nerd. We need to have a discussion. Well, if it isn't my favorite traveler. And oh, what a trip you were on. Why, when you were under, you should have heard some of the things that came out of your mouth. But I suppose you're more interested in what came out of your head, aren't you? Why? <laughs> Why do we do anything? We travel the world, kill people, take trophies that interest you, and move on. I'm much the same. The only difference is that my trophies are somewhat more medical in nature. Oh, and to be honest, I probably kill fewer people than you do. I mean, you're not wrong. But I suppose <laughs> each time that came to an end, one way or another. Ah, uh, you done goofed, dude. You done goofed. You didn't. He did not understand with whom he was fucking. <laughs> well then, that's uh, it's creepy. Which one's mine? Oh no, familiar piece of brain. For some reason, you feel a terrible sense of loss looking as you look at the familiar lump of gray matter. It's mine. <laughs> Can I eat it? Can I eat my own brain? Can I eat it? No, it's not here. Is that under miscellaneous? Love a brain! <laughs> hey, I guess Nadine's in charge here now. We having fun yet? I like her. She's good people. Now that I've got this sweet boat, I guess I can head back home. For a while, anyway. Just wait till Mom sees the haul I'm bringing home. Aww. Okay, let's go. Yeah, enough, Gavin. Let's move. Okay, well, that was a uh, point lookout, I guess. <laughs> it's thing. It was... I still... I probably should have read some of those, uh like logs on those computers that I passed. Maybe that would have told me what the hell those guys' problems were. I don't know, I killed a brain. I found your girl. Well, if it isn't our hero. Oh, shucks. <laughs> got her back. Yes, thank you so much. And now that she's got this boat and carrying all this cargo, well, I can afford to actually pay you. Thank you so much. Don't worry about it. Thank you so much. Oh, hey, I got all my almost all the caps back from that damn ticket. So, yeah, that's gonna be Point Lookout. I'm done with Fallout 3. I did all the DLCs and I did the main quest. So, my name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and for the last time with Fallout 3, I'll see you all in another Let's Play.